With everyone present in this room, I'd like to thank you for coming out. Raise your hands if you know of somebody in the nursing profession. Now with those with the hand raised, keep your hand up if you yourself want to be a nurse. Now I just saw a lot of hands go down, which that does disappoint me, but that's why I'm here today, is so I can persuade you into joining my major, the nursing major. And you might ask me, Nick, why would I ever want to join such a hard major? And my answer to this is with three valid reasons. Reason number one is because there is a shortage of nurses. There, there are all, there's always gonna be nurses needed in the healthcare field. Reason number two is it's a great field to be a part of. It's very interesting, you get a lot out of it. At the end of the day, I just feel like it's really fun. And the whole process of being in the schooling of nursing is very fun. And reason number three is because you're gonna learn about being that helping hand that someone in life is gonna need. And that is just, that touches my heart. I have a question. Why do you think there's a shortage of nurses? I feel there's a shortage of nursing overall because of how challenging the schooling is. But I feel the nursing major here at Ball State does a very good job at um, not making it too difficult, but at the same time, it, it, it's nursing, it has to be difficult. And then you might ask me next, Nick, I don't know what a nurse does. And I'm here to tell you what a nurse does. Basically, a nurse can assess patients for their um, current and past conditions. They're there to help the disease prevention. You can help aid the patient recovery. You can administer medications for the patients, and then you can set up plans of care to help the patient be the best version of themselves. I got a story. So I was in a hospital once for a broken leg, and my nurse wasn't very good to me. I didn't feel like I got the good, good enough care. I'm, I'm so sorry to hear that story, but if my response will make you feel better, I feel if you, with the teaching that I'm getting at Ball State University, I feel you will not have to worry about that problem in the future, not only for you, but not for anyone else. We're learning about all the steps it takes for the care plan to make sure the patient gets the most out of it, and like I previously said, to ensure that they come out better than what they were looking. Thank you for that. And I know it's not all about the money, but with this field, the schooling is worth it because the money is there. With NPs, with earning about 120,000, RNs, 80,000, same with nursing instructors, 80,000. Nursing anesthesiists can actually make up to 200,000, and then the nurses that help deliver the little babies, 120,000. I have a question. Yeah. What kind of nurse do you want to be? Um, I wanna go into that NP range and maybe go into pediatrics, but let me tie in your question to the next slide. And there, with this field, there is such a variety that I could go into that I don't have to be sure while I'm here in this nursing major, but throughout this whole process, I will, I will learn everything I need to know to be a great nurse. Uh, but to go back in your question, I really want to go in the pediatrics and like I've really considered going in the uh, cancer care. Just, I really want to be there for the ones that need the most. But like my slide says, there is so much, I could really do everything. Like, like I could do focused on maybe the heart, the lungs. It, it, it's shocking how wide of a variety. And that can also tie in to why there is also a shortage of nurses, going back to your question, is because there is such a big variety that there's just so many needed to fill in the shoes for being a nurse in this category. And I feel um, with being in the Ball State nursing program, I feel you'll, you'll learn everything you need 
to be an excellent nurse and go out there and know what you want to do, know what, know what um, field you want to go in, and do an excellent job with it. I got a question. What's the difference between RN and nurse practitioner? Um, the big difference is the the RN doesn't have as many responsibilities as a nurse practitioner, and uh, you need two more years of schooling. And I'd like to end by giving you my business card. Please re reach out to me if you consider switching to a nursing major. Thank you.